here i welcome everyone to the youtube channel in this particular video i'll be showing you how you can able to create a ai voice agent and how you can able to create that inside a go high level how to integrate that so if you are into a small business if you're not using an ai voice agent you are missing out the big deal so you need to get this because this is an absolute game changer and especially when it comes to the synflow it takes really one click you can be able to integrate directly inside the go high level and i would be showing you in this video how you can do that so i already done this before so let's get started so the first thing what is required right now is the synflow if you don't have any account so i provided the link in the description box you can click on that and go ahead and register it so once you've done that so what you have to do right now is once uh, you get this account you will able to see this okay so you can able to see this so what you have to do is you can just click on this create agent and you will get the bros templates okay so you will have all the templates you can choose one of this but the goal here is to how to integrate the synth flow directly inside a go high level then let me show you how you can do that so the first thing what is required so i have already uh this is the one one agent what i have right now okay so if if you don't have any number i would be talking about that in the next video how to connect with the, the numbers but let me go ahead and show you the integration part right now okay so once you have this integration as you can see it comes with a go high level integration tell your accounts and 11 labs there zapier and other integrations and also make.com so the synflow is the best easiest way to create this okay and connect it to the uh, different third party uh, applications now if i want to create this so what you have to do right now is can go back to this let me let me show you this okay how how to integrate this the first thing what is required right now is that you can go here and now you need to open the go high level platform so once you create this account right go to go high level platform you have this right now you need to go to the agency account go to the agency account and once you come into the agency account, scroll down, you will see app marketplace. And I have already created, connected this. So you need to type it here. So you need to type the app which you want to um, get this. So I will tap synth flow. Okay, once you once you have the synth flow typed, you will be able to see this. It says install. I already installed it. So once you click here, what are going to happen here is that it will come to this page. You just need to click on this install to the sub account which you want to install. So once you click here, it will ask for sub accounts, right? So you just need to click on this sub account and that's it. It will get installed on that particular account. Okay, so this is the most easiest way with a one click. You just need to follow the instruction and that's it. What happens then? then you will able to see this voice ai but where we need to go right now we will switch back to this where did you install this synflow to for that you need to open the same browser with the synflow or the ai agent mm, sorry the synflow voice account and this one okay so now once you come across with this uh, the dashboard you will be able to see there is a new uh, icon or you can see the new app here that is an voice ai okay this is an ai agent from go high level don't get confused out here it's in a voice ai and you can able to see that whatever happened whatever the this is an account here the the synth flow and everything is synced directly inside the go high level right it is awesome so from here you can able to control your voice you can create anything so you do in right now i am inside a go high level and you can see the synth flow is here right so this is this is awesome all right so it's a one click you can able to uh create this one click you can you can get uh started with a go high level and then 
uh, whenever you create any automations, right? So once you uh, create an uh, automation, I have created the pipeline or automation. I would be showing you in the next video. You can able to connect this phone call. It is so simple. Let me show you this here, okay? It is easy. Once you come to the automation here and the go high level, if you already know it, you can create it from, if you come across with um, workflows, you can create a workflow. Then once you create the workflow, it will come here. You can just create a contact tag that is outbound call or inbound call. Then for this, what you have to do here is that, so let me show you here. So for that, so for an example, if I click here and now I will type, you just need to scroll down a bit, okay? Once you have this scroll down, all right, you will see make a phone call. This is directly integration from Synthflow. So once you have this so easy, all right, so it's, it, it will ask for the raw number. You have to have this API key. In the next video, I'll be showing you how you can able to integrate this API key, how to assign a phone number inside this. As you can see, it asks for a phone number, how to go to Telio and get this number and connect it to this and how you can get started with a phone call directly inside the Go High Level platform. Okay, how you can trigger a phone call inside this. And also I would be showing you how you can able to pull the data directly from the synth flow and make a decisions on is, is the call answered, appointment booked, interested, busy or not interested or voicemail. So all the executions happens at the back end. I would be showing you how you can create this automation so that it works completely on automation. All right. So, uh, but right now I'll be showing you one of the demos right now to show you how the phone call works. Look at this in ball triggers happens, the finds the contacts, it's contact has been found, it's updates, and then uh, it takes the conditions. It comes here and it answered the call and it comes with the tag note. What is call note and create an opportunities. And this is how it works. So easy. I'm not confusing much. All right. So this is easy in the, you just subscribe and like so that you get notification in the next video. I'll be covering everything inside how to do a phone call, how to configure it, how to write the prompts, how to integrate this phone call, how to pull the data from Synthflow to the go high level, how to automate the process, everything inside this YouTube channel for absolutely free. So subscribe to this YouTube channel and like and uh, see you in the next video. Thank you very much.